alone. Well, back here at home, Congressman Scott Taylor announced he is dropping out of a WHRO-sponsored debate this fall with Democrat Elaine Luria. Taylor and Luria are both running for the 2nd Congressional District. Taylor says he's unhappy with the station's coverage of an effort by paid Taylor staffers to get independent candidate Sean Brown on the ballot. So in a statement, Taylor said of the debate, quote, WHRO. HRO was alerted in writing and with evidence that their employee, who has written and in part is helping to organize the debate, is a rabid anti-Scott Taylor attacker online and even called Trump supporters thumbless imbeciles, end quote. A 13 News Now investigation has uncovered that some of the signatures collected by Taylor staffers appear to be forged. Now, some signatures are of people who have passed away, and Democrat Elaine Luria spoke with us about those questionable signatures. I'm out campaigning, knocking thousands of doors, talking to voters, and we're talking about issues that are important to people across the 2nd District. So I'm really not concerned if there's two or other th three uh, people on the ballot. I think that our message will carry weight. Yesterday, the Virginia Democratic Party filed a lawsuit to try and get Sean Brown off the ballot over those petition signatures. So Brown's attorney released a statement critical of the effort, saying, quote, to try to remove her now after having been certified is further proof of the lack of commitment by the Democratic Party to our representative democracy born here in Virginia. In